Are we in an AI bubble right now? AI spending seems like the common theme over the past few weeks after big tech companies like Nvidia, Meta, Alphabet and even Amazon announced their Q3 earnings. The headlines are screaming growth, but the data tells an even more complex story. Nvidia just broke 5 trillion in market cap, Amazon signed a 38 billion deal with OpenAI, Microsoft's pouring billions into data centers across UAE, and Meta its stock fell because its AI spending ballooned faster than its profits. So what does this mean for you? For investors, this isn't a time for hype. It's a time for strategy. Here's how to think like a quant and stay ahead. Number one, read beneath the noise. The truth is, AI isn't one bubble. It's a repricing of future demand. Every tech cycle starts with euphoria and ends with winners who actually deliver utility. Instead of chasing tickers, ask yourself this. Who builds the infrastructures others depend on? Because that's where capital compounds long after the hype fades. Follow the supply chain, not the headline. Number two, ignore narratives, read data. Forget just earnings reports. Track cloud capital expenditure forecasts. Look at CapEx trends. Alternative data like semiconductor demand or energy consumption in data centers can tell you where real growth is brewing before earnings do. Number three, think in probabilities, not possibilities. This is the core of quant thinking. When AI buzz spikes but earnings flatten, volatility tells the truth faster than headlines. Don't ask, is this company the next big thing? Ask, what is the probability that this investment generates a return, given the current data? The market is a pricing machine. Your edge is calculating the odds better than anyone else by stress testing every narrative against hard numbers. So, back to the question, are we in an AI bubble? Maybe, maybe not. But the real edge is seeing which bubbles built the next wave of infrastructure. Stay data-driven, stay rational, and follow us if you want to know how to think like a quant.